So I bet you're pretty excited to get started, huh? Now that we've gone over all of the things that are going to be covered in this course, it's time to get started. So the first thing we want to do is get out our spreadsheet. Yeah, spreadsheet. So this is where everything starts. What you do is you sit down with a director and you're going to go through the movie and you're going to spot the things that need music. This is an actual spotting sheet from a movie that I worked on. On the left, you'll see the name of the queue. You'll see a status column next to that, approval, name of the queue, the time in, the time out. This is pretty standard for a spotting sheet. You've got a description of it, source, so this is where music might be coming from if it was taken from CD or whatever. And then music notes. So these are notes for the composer. And then we have whether it's going to be score or whether it's pre-recorded. Uh, we have purchase, licensor, all this stuff. So this is a very important document if you are working on a longer form film or if you're working in TV. You should demand this, actually. Uh, make one yourself. Open up a spreadsheet program such as Excel or Numbers and just make one yourself. Make a template of this. You can copy what I've got here uh, verbatim if you like. But this is where the conversation begins as far as scoring the picture is concerned. You want to make sure that you get with the director and you have a very clear understanding of where things are going to be and how long they're going to be. The only problem that arises with spotting sheets is these days, there's no such thing as a locked picture. Usually when we did music in the past to picture, we got a locked picture. And that meant there were no more edits that were going to be done to the picture. And the time code and the times that we see within our document were what we were going to end up with in the final movie. This isn't always the case now, unfortunately. So keep that in mind as you work going forward. If you're working with independent people, this may be something fairly new to them, and you can educate them. You can like sit down with them and watch the movie, spot it together, and figure out what you're going to do with the music. Okay, now that we've gone over that, we need to start building our template. 